we're gonna be deep frying everything off the McDonald's menu. Oh my God, that's burning my eyes. Ah, I can't see, I'm blind. Just treat it like, you know. Treat it like it's a woman. <laughs> treat it like a woman. Right, three, two, one. What is up guys, how is it going? And welcome back to the channel. Woo! We're here. I'm back. He's back, he's back. And mate, we have a insane video today. I'm excited, what are we doing? So the other week I deep fried some foods and to be honest, all the foods that I tried were amazing. They were so tasty. Now, have you ever deep fried anything before? Uh, like, no, no, I, went, I don't, I mean, maybe when we did the chips. Be careful, oh. turn it down, turn it down. Oh my God, it's, that is, yeah, that's a wow, woof. That's bubbling. It's on the burgers. Oh yeah, we deep, we deep fried was, was some KFC. Deep, was that deep frying? Was that yeah, like but it, and oil? yeah, but it wasn't a deep fried machine, but it was basically deep frying. Apart yeah. from, no, no not really. Uh, yeah, no. Because I, 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 I did on the burger van. <laughs> I did on the burger van, but I was never allowed to pull it in. On the burger van? Yeah, I was only ever allowed to empty the oil. I weren't allowed to like cook in it. Oh, why? Did they not trust you? No, they just gave me the more dangerous job of emptying the oil. Oh, God, yeah, what? That does sound, was it hot though? Yeah, one time I spilled on me. They weren't burning, but I then just had to sit in the car for six hours, stinking with greasy hair, while everyone was shouting at me to stop moaning. That sounds awful. And I was like, wouldn't you moan if you had dirty oil down you? Would you not be moaning I mean, yeah, if I would, you had I would be cooking, creepy, used it? cooking oil covered, like, covered you, and then you didn't get back until seven in the morning, and then you had to pay for a taxi to get home, because they wouldn't even take you home. Yeah, I'd be fuming. Because our car broke down on the motorway. I'd be fuming. So today, I thought we'd do something that hopefully is going to taste very good, but it's going to be pretty unhealthy. Are you ready I'm, for I'm that? I'm down. I'm always down to be unhealthy. All right. So I thought, why don't we order loads of things off the McDonald's menu, yeah. deep fry them, and see what tastes better? Normal McDonald's or deep fried McDonald's? That sounds actually like a good idea. I'm excited. Comment below if you think deep fried will be better than the non deep fried food. And before we start, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and give us a thumbs up. Right, so the first thing we need to do, we need to make the batter for the deep fry. So get the ingredients. All right, so we, we got milk. Oat milk. Yeah, oat milk. Yep, perfect. We've got a bowl. Bowl. Oh. Scales. We've got scales. Okay. We've got baking powder. Yep. We've got plain white flour. Yep. We've got a whisk. And then you've got the recipe. Oh yeah. Right, so what, what have you got to do then? Uh, 340 grams of plain flour. Okay, but you need to turn that on well, first. obviously. Well, I, I really question you in the kitchen, so. So 340 grams of plain flour. And you ready, this is going to be on the dot, 340, not above, no below. Well, all of it? Yeah, it's going to be, exa no, not, not what's in here, but oh. I'm going to get exactly. <laughs> okay, go on then, go. On the dot, 350. Go on then. Go on then. <laughs> you gotta get it all in, get it all in. Keep going. Get the rest of the bag. No way. Oh my god, imagine. Oh no! 330! No, no. That's it, that's three. No. I, I think I think 330 is fine. You know, you nearly got there. The whole bag I'm is nine, only 350. I'm 0.9 G's off. Nine I'm nine grams off, not 0.9. <laughs> Alright, cool. Well then you need to do. Um, One tablespoon of baking powder. Yeah, do the spoon of bake bake the baking powder? Is the table teaspoon the teaspoon's a small one, isn't it? Like this one. I don't know, mate. I trust yeah. you. Is that too much? I mean, yeah, that's a that's a blooming heat thing. That that's gotta be a teaspoon. I mean, yeah. It's taken you three attempts to get an accurate teaspoon right. measurement. Teaspoon. <laughs> I usually just go like that, quick. Okay, time. and then we need so we've got 170 of no, uh, water. water. So I mean, that in now? Well, I'll just do this and then we've got the milk in as well. Oh, that's not very. Are you sure it's in date? Yeah, it's oat milk. Alright, uh, if, you, if, you, if you say so. This doesn't come from a cow, you know. It comes from oats. So it comes from the ground? Well, oats. Yeah, so you're telling me that comes from. But oats are dry, so how does. Uh, mix it. Oh, no, 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 don't spill it, don't spill I'm it, not don't gonna spill it. it. Well, you've already spilled some there. I think we need more water. That just looks like thick, cut, like. It looks like mud, but like a light coloured mud. I'm gonna get you some more water because I think that's what we're gonna need. Right, while you do that, I'm gonna get the deep frying machine out. Beautiful machine. Love the deep fryer. Me and the deep fryer go really hand in hand. Should I continue stirring it? Just so I'm actually doing something around and just standing there. <laughs> looks better for the shot, you know what I mean? 
<laughs> yeah, the whole video, you, you need, need to stay out. there and just to, what is that? What yeah. is the black stuff? I have no idea. Okay, so this is the deep fryer. Can I put this the thing, oil what? Can I put the oil in it? So I just wanted to do something. <laughs> right, so this is the deep fryer. This thing is gonna get really hot. Oh, I know. So just like stay away from it, basically, because this thing will just get you. Did I tell you about the time at the work when uh, on the burger van when the woman put her hand in the deep fryer accidentally and she burnt her hand? She thought mate, she turned it off. Mate, this burger van sounds like the worst. Like, and then she no, she was pregnant as well, and then she and then she was what? cooking. She was cooking the next day. Okay, right. We need the oil in, so we need three liters of oil out, please, James. That's already getting really hot, so mm -hmm. just be careful. The worst thing is that on the, on the car on the way home, I fell asleep on her. You fell asleep on the woman. On the pregnant woman, my head was on her chest. Uh, she's, apparently I was using her as a pillow. I had a good sleep, that's what I'm gonna say. <laughs> this is just getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> so, um, yeah, we, so we've got to pour that whole thing in, because that's two litres, but don't like pour it in slowly. Yeah, you can pour it in. What, all the way like this now? Well, yeah, you just pour it in. Keep going, keep going, keep going. You see the skill? Keep going. Right, so we're gonna need, we're gonna need some more, because we need it up to the max. Yeah, line. we'll just use half of this one, or we'll about half. Stop. <laughs> right, okay, we got the oil in. So the deep fryer has uh, finished heating up. Our McDonald's order has arrived. What should we start with to deep fry? Should we do nuggets? Some chicken, yeah. so we're gonna, we're gonna batter the battered chicken nuggets. Yeah, we're gonna double batter them and then double cook them in the fryer. Okay, this is gonna be bad. <laughs> okay, right, we got the 20 chicken nuggets here. So do you wanna put two chicken nuggets in, nuggets? Put two chicken nuggets in the batter. Batter those babies up. No, you need to drop them in. I'll drop them in, okay. Get make sure there's batter evenly. Now you don't want to put them both in at the same time because you don't want to batter them together. No, no. So, put one in there. God, it's going to go everywhere. I know it's going to go everywhere. Right, go, put it in. And now another one, wherever it is. He's lost it. He's lost it. He's lost the nuggets. James, you had it, it's there. All right, put it in. Oh my God, right, okay. And it's going down, three, two, one. Nuggets are in. Nuggets are down. Right, okay. See, that's the problem. They stick and now they're stuck. Because we left them too long while we, you were getting the fork. We've got some stuck nuggets and they won't come out. <laughs> Back in they go. Right, so our first nuggets are, are stuck. ruined it's and It's your stuck. fault because you don't have the fork ready. For safety, I'm gonna deep fry two nuggets to just, you know, make sure. They're fine. Well, they might be fine in your eyes, but... All right, well, I'll eat those two and you eat your two. Well, I don't think you're gonna be able to get those two off. That's the only problem. All right, we're gonna just batter it up. There we go. I've caused more of a mess than you have. Yeah. <laughs> I'll laugh if your two get stuck. I'll actually laugh. Oh, look at that. I don't think they are. Sorted, frying away. All right, let's put the top on. Let's come back once they're fried. Right, so these have been sizzling now. I think we better open them up. Oh, look at that. They look good. Wow. Right, we need to, look. These ones look amazing. But these ones, James, these are like, they're like so stuck, it's a joke. Right, so we've got one deep fried nugget there, another, Deep fried nugget there. So what's your thoughts? Well, these ones look nicer. Y what, than the deep fried ones? Yeah, because they look cleaner. What do you think the taste is going to be there? I actually don't know. Because these are perfect already. So I wonder if they're going to improve on it. I think they, they might be a little bit cold now. But these, 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 these have like tripled in size. You never know, they could be nicer. I want you to let me know in the comment section below, what do you think is going to taste nicer? The normal McDonald's chicken nuggets or the deep fried chicken nuggets? Nuggets. <laughs> We're going to use a dip or no? No dip? No, no dip. Just go for it. Mm. Thing is, you can't beat a chicken nugget. No, you can't beat a McDonald's chicken nugget. Mm. Wow. That's good. You ready for this? Not yet. Not yet. My word. You're eating like a granny. Get your dentures out. Bloody hell, mate. Five oh. years to chew with one, no, one oh, nugget. That's what you Right, I'm going to move on to this one in a minute, bro. You're actually, you're joking now, aren't you? I must admit, they're a little bit dry, aren't they? <laughs> That's why I said 
said about the sauce is so dry that you can't, you've got no moisture to swallow it. Do you want a drink? Like, it's gone. I'll swallow okay, it. Okay, right. Are you ready? Oh, so you give me the big one, yeah? Yeah, well, I'm, I'm oh, gonna, there's, I'm, still quite I'm gonna dip this one. Yeah, I might dip it as well. <laughs> what do oh, you think? It's good, but I can just, all I can taste is the temperature in my mouth. It's like so hot. <laughs> all I can taste in my mouth is the temperature. I didn't know temperature had a taste. No, it's just like so hot in my mouth. So you don't like it? No, I do. I, I do. actually, you know what? Like, I feel like you can't beat a normal nugget. It tastes nice, but I feel like you just can't beat a it's, normal nugget. It's not nugget. an improvement. It's nice, but it's not better. No, it's just I wouldn't kind say of, it's nicer. Just kind of like extra batter. Yeah, it, just, it doesn't improve it. Okay, now I've already done this in one of the last videos, yeah. but deep frying a double cheeseburger. Sounds interesting. Do you think you'd like it? Well, you don't like I don't normal. Like, I don't like the normal McDonald's. Can I, can I batter it? <laughs> Sorry, that was really random, but can I batter it? I love how there's, when there's anything that you can possibly, can I, Ollie, please, can I batter well, it, I please? I just want to do can something. I go and get a, can I get the fork for you? <laughs> I just want to do so I don't want to be standing. Alright, go on then, batter it. Oh. Look at that battered burger right there. Oh god, it's a lot heavier already. Yeah mate, it's gonna be so heavy. You ready? No, are you? No. Oh my word! It's, a... it's gone in! It's gone in! The burger! Oh god, if it gets stuck. No, it's not. It's not got stuck. It's all good. Right, let's put the top on. James, we yep. are Chefs. deep frying. Well, we deep are chefs. chefs. We are deep frying a whole burger. <laughs> I feel American. <laughs> I don't think Americans deep fry burgers. Well, they deep fry Mars bars. Yeah, but have you ever had a deep fried Mars bar? No, because it sounds horrible. Right. You know what? That is exactly what I thought. Do you know why you think that? Why? Because when you think of battered, you think of fish, right? Like yeah. a battered fish. So I thought it would then taste like a battered fish, but the batter tastes amazing. Are we still filming? Can I step away while we cook it? You really want to go and sit down that quickly, do you? No, I'm just doing research at the moment. Research? About what? This is the new gun. The new gun? Yeah. On what? Uh, Call of Duty Warzone, basically. Well, basically, I'm in the top six. Basically, I need. Do you know I'm, what I'm someone in the said? Top six percent. No, no, no. Someone said in the comments of the last video, they said they had like 34 wins and they weren't even in the top 10 percent. Do you want me to show you? I'm, I swear to God, on the multiplayer, I am on the top six percent. It says I go on PS4. And then he realizes there's an extra zero at no, the end and it's 60 no, percent. <laughs> you know what we should do? Deep frying donuts, like Krispy Kreme. Oh, that would be good. We could start a business, you know, we could get rid of that whole van, you know, that pink van, we could build our own one in Stevenage. What pink? Oh my God, we'll do our own Dunkin' yeah, Donuts. Yeah. Oh man, that's how you do it. But we triple double, we triple. We triple cook. No, because you know what? Then you get a bit too much grease. Look at that burger. Oh my word. What do you think of that? Do you like that? Yeah, it looks nice. Well, it, it looks a bit burnt. Would but... you just eat this little bit of batter right there? No, not even, <laughs> no, not even for the most amount of money. I I'll it. give you three million pounds. <laughs> and here is the beautifully battered burger. I mean, I won't say beautifully. <laughs> Would you eat that? If, if, if you ordered something from McDonald's and they went, there you go. I'd ask for a full refund and double. I'd say you're giving a me- A double refund. You're giving me more, you're giving me what I paid you and you're paying me for what you gave that. All right, well, before we get into the battered double cheeseburger, it's time for the normal cheeseburger. Yeah, let's do it. You have that slice, I'll have this, right. He's, he's looking at it like, oh my god, there's gherkins, oh my god, there's onion. No there's one relish, I know my age likes cheese, gherkins, relish, lettuce, onions, cheese, lettuce, There's anything. meat, there's a bun, there's salt, there's pepper. <laughs> so what bit are you going to eat then? This bit. What? Yeah, but you have to eat the meat as well, right? Yeah, this Otherwise, is the meat. Otherwise, it's not a fair test. This is the meat. Okay, go on and go. Mmm. Did you get a gherkin? There's no gherkins in it, trust me. No, no, I'm just trying to eat it without... <laughs> without throwing up? No, I really don't like it. I really don't like it. You really don't like it? We say, James, what do you want from McDonald's, mate? Can I get uh, a burger with just a patty and no cheese in a bun? James will get no, just No, I'll a... get cheese. Really? Yeah. I like cheese, I just don't oh. like... You don't like all the other bits? No. So what would you rate that then? What if I was just to buy that? Yeah, out of 10. 2.5. 2.5, I'd rate that like an eight. I would 
get rid of all the vegetables apart from the um, ketchup because I've got tomatoes and that's a vegetable. I'm gonna remove all the vegetables but the ketchup vegetable. Okay. Because technically it's kind of it's but the ketchup vegetable. Right. What are you having tonight? Well, I'm gonna have some chicken and then maybe some ketchup. Basically, no, you just got a bowl of ketchup. No, technically this is eating the ketchup. Technically, ketchup is kind of a vegetable. Yeah, but it's literally yeah. just like full of sugar. Okay. The burger. We're gonna cut it open and see what what magic holds in this. I think I like the deep beautiful fried substance. One more. Right, ready? Oh, it's hot. Oh, that's burning my hands. Is it actually, is it that hot? Ready? Three, two, one. There we are. Oh, okay, see, that looks a lot nicer. Oh, because you know why? The cheese is melted. No, but Woo! not even that. It just looks like a coating on top of the bun. I always thought these were going to be like proper greasy. It's not that greasy. Right, do you want to actually go for it? Well, if you want to go for it, we'll go for it. Well, yeah, I mean, otherwise we're going to wait here all day oh, just yeah, staring right, at right, it. All right, I'll burn my mouth, I'll burn my mouth. No, 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 just be gentle with it. Just treat it like, you treat know. Treat it like it's a woman. <laughs> treat it like a woman? What, a burger? Well, no, just a, be gentle with it. A battered burger. You're going to be gentle with it. Just take yeah. a little bite because I don't know how hot it's going to be. But look at that, it looks all melted inside. It's literally so hot on your fingers, isn't it? Yeah. Gently. Oh my god, that is so nice. No? It tastes like a, kind of like a donut in a way, isn't it? <laughs> the donut burger. But did you get any of the meat? Yeah. With the cheese? The I mean, cheese. I like that bit, but I don't like yeah. the, 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 the Actually, um, I agree with you on that. What would you rate that out of 10 then? Would it be higher? five out of 10. So that would be higher than would, a normal. I would rather eat this. Well, obviously, without the certain vegetables, I don't know, but I'd rather eat this rather than the normal cheeseburger. But you said if if you got served that, you want a double double refund. So what would you say now? A double 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 refund for putting the vegetables in. All right, so that was the deep fried burger. Yep. Okay, moving on to the next one. It is McDonald's fries. Now. I don't think we should batter these, no, right? No, let's just fry them like, straight wanna, in. Because the thing is, right, with McDonald's fries, they're great, but look, they got... I wasn't going to eat oh, it. Well, I am. Right, well, it's cold, right? Yeah. It's cold. Okay, I'll try this. So we're doing the taste test before. It, it's cold and it's soggy, basically. And that's the problem with McDonald's. Like, look, sog. So hopefully, with frying them, they'll kind of get back their perkiness. Right, you hold that because you can pour it in because I know you're going to say, oh, is it alright if I pull the chips oh, in? shut up, man. <laughs> right, okay. Pour them in ever so carefully so they don't splash. Burger boy James, call them in. All of them? Yep. In they go. And then just, yeah, put them in the oil, mate. He knows what he's doing. He's been on that burger van. There we are. Cooking. We Look at that. It. That's a good sight right there. That's when you know you're, you're cooking the chips right. Right, I think these chips are done. Okay, right. Does that look done, James? Shake them about. Yeah, they're done. Yeah? yeah. Right, put them on the latch. Boom. Uh, do do we need to like salt them? Yeah, 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 yeah. Where's the salt? Right. So, so this is our this is our very own McDonald's can uh, I, workstation. Can I empty the chips into the bowl? Go on then. Thank you. Well done, James. Round of applause. And I should go on Britain's Got Talent for that. Right, so then we'll sprinkle a little bit of salt over it. Yeah, just a sprinkling. All right, mate. We've got our I'm chips. excited. Go on, then you go. Look at that. Look at the strength of that chip. It's not falling at all. Eat one right now. On my web. Wow. That's unbelievable. It's like they've just been cooked right now. Well, they have. Sam. Maybe a little bit too much, but that is. That's perfect. Slightly too long in the fire, but they're so much nicer than when they come so Oh my in. god, they're actually amazing. So, what would you rate the normal chips? Eight out of ten. If you get eight, no, actually, no, maybe I'd say a solid nine. If you get them from the restaurant, I would say I would say like a seven. But if you get them from the restaurant, if you get a delivery, I feel like it goes down because yeah, they get yeah, a bit soggy. You, I'd say eight from the restaurant because they're like brand new cooked. But yeah, delivery maybe like a four point five five. And then what would you say after us frying? Ten. Literally 10. Like, like, you can't beat those chips. You can't beat them. No. Right, so moving on to the next one. What we got, James? Chicken selects. Chicken selects. Now, these right here are my go-to. Like, oh, yeah, whenever they're... I order, they go to. Look at them. They look blimmin' lovely. But we're going to have one normal one, and then we're going to batter one and see what the difference is. Guys, let us know in the comment section below. What one do you think is going to taste better? The original McDonald's one or one after we've battered it? I reckon the battered one. 
Right, so let's just put one on a plate so that we can cut in half. I'll just do this. I can just, it, you already smell like the seasoning on it. It's nice, oh, it? smells so nice. Right. right, James, can you put a chicken select in and batter it up, please? Yeah. James, the connoisseur of battering. Right, hold on, this is gonna go everywhere. Right, and go. Put, pour it down, put it down. Yep. There we are, we've done it. Is there gonna be a well done James there? Or? Well done James, congratulations mate. You have battered your first chicken strip. Right, so while that's cooking, should we have this, yeah, uh, yeah. we'll have this chicken, chicken strip. I've got a feeling it's gonna be very dry again. Oh God, I took a big oh. bit and it's dry. Mm. It's still amazing. It's still great. Okay, so I think the select has been done. Right. If I lift the lid up, would you like to yes, I would put like it to. there to drain it? Oh, that looks good. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's a beastie chicken select right there. My word. Wow. I want to know, what would you rate the McDonald's chicken select well, without as a being take battered? Away, as a takeaway. Or? Yeah, as a takeaway. As we just had it, I'd say a four out of 10. As we ate it. Because it's cold. It's cold, it's soggy. I would. I, I mean, I even like you when it's soggy. I would say it's an eight when it's like hot. Yeah, when it's hot, it's easily an eight out of 10. But now, when it's cold, it's not. So you're saying a four. And so, I think this cold gets half points. So this is, this is going to beat it just purely on being hot. Well, the batter might ruin the whole thing. The batter might, might deduct points, you never know. I just don't so this like all is, this This is more interesting stuff. than Wimbledon. What, seeing if a battered, a battered yes. thing is going to be... No like what kind of teenager wants to watch a foot, watch grown men throw like hit balls at each other? I love tennis and I'd love to watch Wimbledon. Everyone loves Wimbledon. No one my age loves to watch Wimbledon. It's because your age, I'm the only thing that they know how out. to do is be on your phones. You guys need to get out there and play some sports, you know? Like, like tennis. it's all about sports. Tennis is like, tennis is like a middle-aged man sort of sport. Oh my God, all right, what's a really cool sport? Yeah, Muay boxing. Thai, basically Muay Thai, boxing, anything that makes me look really masculine is basically cool. Yeah. No. So like rugby, Tennis boxing, is amazing. Muay Thai. The only reason you don't like tennis is because you can't hit the ball. Right, let's try this. Oh, wow. My word, I can't even get through it. Struggling. Right. That is what it's like. It's very hot. Yeah. It smells amazing though. I'm gonna give it a little dip, dip. So it's yeah, cool it's cool it down. Bit. Yeah, good idea. Right, ready? Oh, it's hot. It's hot. I think the batter ruins it. It, it ruins it. It just takes away flavor. Yeah, it just really. tastes like flour. It get, it I much prefer it with um, without being battered. For sure. Oh, that was that was like too hot as well. You can't really taste what it is. It, it's just a bit. It's you've just got, like plain. You've got literally. Look at that, right? You have got literally half batter, half no, half chicken. Not even half chicken, like quarter chicken. <laughs> quarter chicken, half batter. Now for this next one, James. This may sound very strange to you, but I can it? assure you it's going to be great. Okay. McDonald's fruit. We're going to batter it. And we're gonna cook it. All right, we can try it. <laughs> One thing I don't get here, fair enough they try and be healthy, but who goes to McDonald's and orders apple slices? Me. You have to be a special kind of person to do that. I am very special. Right, I've got some grapes in. They've only given us three grapes. Oh no, there's more. All right, let me try the apple slice. Can we try? It's, it's quite even nice. dry, it's not like a nice it's apple. It's quite a nice apple. It's a very sweet apple. I'm gonna do this one. What? Yeah, because I want, I don't want it to go everywhere. Chip, bloop, bloop. Oh my god, that's burning my eyes! Ah! Oh my god! Woo! Whoa! That all went right in my eye hole. Your eye hole. Right in my eye. Ah! I can't see. I'm blind. I'm actually blind. Whoa! It stinks. I don't care what you say, I'm not dipping the apple in barbecue sauce. Right, these things are sizzling so much. Ready? Ooh. Oh my word, right, so put them up. They don't even look like fruit anymore. Well, what, what would you rate it? Well, you haven't eaten. You haven't even eaten the skin. James is eating it like a four-year-old. Look, you've eaten that bit of apple like a four-year-old. Right, what, what would you rate it? Two out of 10. Right, I'd rate it about five, six. It was kind of sweet, very nice, um, but want a bit more flavor. But these, we've got a gray peach. There's your gourmet meal. And we've got an apple slice each. 
I just realised they might be really hot, so they're like juice inside it, you know. I'm gonna cu I'm gonna cut it open, see what it's like. Oh, I know this is gonna be amazing. Oh mate, this is gonna be so nice because it's gonna be. Have you ever had an apple pie before? Yeah, I don't yeah, like I hate apple, apple pie. pie. <laughs> it's gonna be like that. It's gonna be really hot though. Yeah, it's gonna. It's like super hot. Right, while we wait for that to cool down, there's one last thing we need to batter and deep fry, and I wanted to go big. All right, what are we doing? We're going to be battering and deep frying a Big Mac. <laughs> if a double cheeseburger couldn't get big enough, we've got a bit, oh my word, look at that salad, I mean, James. I don't even like Big Macs. Look, look at that salad. Wow. I can't stand a Big Mac on a normal day, so. We're going to batter this. Are you, are you ready? Right, battering the burger. Move the prong out of the way. There you are. Oh my word, look at that. Yeah, try and keep it intact. That is probably the best we're gonna is, is looking pretty battered to me. That is a battered burger right there. This abominable thing. Right, ready? It's going in, Sam, ready? Oh my God, look, it's just seeping out. It's not even all in. It's not even a burger anymore. No! That looks absolutely rank. Imagine if you got in like that. It asked for a triple, 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 triple double refund. Yeah. Right. What else doing? It's time to eat. Apple. Let's go. Oh my word. Wow. That is amazing. Well, that my literally apple fell out. They fell, fell out. I put this in my mouth, bit it down, and the apple right, fell so out you... my casing. Right. No, I did. I did get the. Right. Eat that then. No, you ate from. Yeah, that. But you need to eat the batter. I did with eat the, apple. the batter. There was some batter in my mouth. Where do you think this batter chunk went? But did it taste like an apple pie? Yes. And what did you think of it? Horrible. That is literally like a McDonald's apple pie right there. Wow. And now the grape. The grape. The grape. The grape. I've never known someone to eat a grape that's battered so weirdly. Ten times better. You're like than using apple. using both hands going. Sharp man, it's ten times better than the apple. <laughs> they both were really good. The fruit battering and deep frying is actually really nice. I would say that's probably like because that reminds me of an apple pie. I'd rather, I'd say that's probably about seven or an eight. I'd say about two or three. Oh my word! It's getting a bit freaky in here. We did it. We've done it. Oh yeah, that is too much. Oh my god. So. Out of all the things that we tried so far, bar the Big Mac, what has been your favourite thing, unbattered and battered? Chips unbattered. Yeah. The ch oh my god, the chips were so good. And then the nugget bat battered. The nuggets battered. Yeah. Oh. I would actually say that the apple is one of my favourites, just because it's like a, you know, it's a little bit of a sweet thing, you know, it's not savoury, uh, whereas everything else has been savoury. But um, yeah, those chips, I think they were absolute top notch. All right, are you ready for this? I'm ready. The deep fried Big Mac. Are we ready? Three, two, one. Oh my word. Look at, what is that? <laughs> that is an absolute joke. Look at it. That is an absolute monster. Oh my God. The what? burger's gone black. <laughs> Look at James's face. <laughs> Looks horrible, man. I think what it is, is that it's just, it's been battered, basically. Well, yeah, obviously. <laughs> right, let's take this out. Okay. Oh my God, it's heavy. Really? It's a burger. Wow. That right there is the lettuce. Look at that. It's like burnt lettuce. James, I can tell you want a bit of that, don't you? No. You um... want a bit of that burnt lettuce in your life. Right, let's, let's cut this. Oh my God. I don't even, I can't stand Big Mac on a big day, so like... Because it has gherkins and that in it. Wow, look at, look at that. Oh my word, the top bit just seems like it's just, it's battered the whole bun. Okay, right, three, two, one. Oh look, the, the patty bit's gone black. That is, by far, the worst. The absolute worst. <laughs> I need to go and eat some vegetables now. I need to relax and probably go for a workout. 
Yeah. Well, there we are, guys. Thank you so much for watching. That was deep frying uh, things off the McDonald's menu. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give the video a thumbs up. Hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, and leave in the comment section below um, if you liked the video. Oh no, no. Which one would be your favourite? Yeah, which one would be your favourite? <laughs> we will see you guys next time with another video. Bye bye. See ya. So his name is Ollie White, and he's the best in the land. Cause every single video he makes is always gonna be grand. Click on his page if you wanna see more. He's got more subs than a jail audio store. You came man, he's not from down under.